You've just built a new PC or maybe you've upgraded your hardware and now it's time to download and install Windows 11 for free. I'm Boyd and Kelly. To get started with your fresh install of Windows 11, make sure you have a USB flash drive with the Windows 11 installation media ready. If you don't have one, you'll need a USB flash drive with at least eight gigabytes of space and access to a Windows computer to create it. I've linked the direct download for Microsoft's media creation tool down below. Once you've created your installation media, here's a quick warning before we dive in. If you're installing a fresh copy of Windows 11 on your PC's main drive, make sure you're okay with everything on that drive being completely wiped. Otherwise, you risk losing your data. Also, unplug any other internal or external drives to avoid accidentally formatting the wrong one. Not that I would know anything about that. All right, let's get started. Plug in your USB flash drive with the Windows 11 installer and power on your PC. When it starts booting, press the key for your boot menu. This key varies depending on your motherboard, but it's usually F12, F10, or sometimes Escape. Once your PC boots from the USB flash drive, the Windows 11 setup window will appear. From there, just follow the prompts. It's pretty straightforward. Now, here are a few quick tips to avoid headaches later. One, make sure your motherboard's BIOS is up to date. That can cause a lot of problems if it's not. Also, I've linked direct GPU driver downloads for both NVIDIA and AMD GPUs if you need them. And definitely make sure to run Windows updates. That way, everything's up to speed. If you get stuck at any point, drop a comment and either I or someone else from the PC community will help out. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up or thumbs down if it didn't and I'll make a better one next time. Subscribe if you want more from me and I'll see you soon.